Greetings everyone, this is Riyad from Bichikami here. Today we are back in our most evil Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough with Dark Urge, the level 3 evil warlock, Shadowheart, the cleric, uh, not Will, <laughs> he's not in our party, Astarion, the assassin, and Lazel, a fighter. So where we left off, we just got destroyed by the phase spider matriarch. And even though we could go back and fight her, instead we're gonna we're going to continue along the main quest as best we can. Alright, so let's leave camp and make our way towards where we believed Carlock was hanging out. That's right, Shadowheart had some dialogue before we died. Let me guess. You're wondering why the wound on my hand. It never quite heals. And sometimes it causes terrible pain to rip through me. Cool. Alright, let's backtrack out of here. Oh great, this spiderweb bridge. Alright everyone, just stumble through it. Come on. Alright, sweet. We all made it through. Back into the Blight Village. The, the exit was over here, I believe. Yeah, the shabby wooden doors. Let's see what this does. What? <laughs> I definitely came in from here. Did it lock behind us? Someone there. Oh, for a skeleton key. All right, Astarion, opening it up. We got plus 7 on a difficulty 10. Okay, yeah, definitely. Made it through, thankfully. And we got 11 thieves tools, it looks like. Well, 10 now. It's kind of annoying how that locked behind us, because we definitely didn't lock it after we went in there. Ah, well. Let us do another save, just so we don't have to... Um... Exit the Whispering Depths again. Now let's see. We want to head northward to meet up with Carlock, I think, or to find her. Oh, there is a cellar down here as well. We can search for something because we found a thing in the um, in the Whispering Depths. I think it was... yeah, it was this one. Search this, the cellar. We also need to keep our eyes open for our Susser tree whenever we enter the Underdark. But for now, let's check out the cellar. And after we do that, then we'll head north up here, where we can hunt down Karlok. Alright, southward we go. We should be wary of goblins and stuff as well. Oh, there's also a waypoint here, it looks like. Perfect. So that cellar seems like it's down here somewhere. Nothing. You sniffing where you ain't ought to be, friend. I have to take that nose. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Let's intimidate them. Oh, this is Starion. <laughs> Whoops. That's not great. <laughs> Nah, let's just continue. We're gonna fight these jerks anyways. Garbage. 
Alright. We can throw something in there, potentially. What do you have in your inventory, Starion? Centro. Oh wow, there is a big fellow up there. Thankfully, those guys are not in combat. Let's see, can you jump up here? Not enough space. This fellow. And then there is a third one somewhere. I think they are over here. Yeah, they're down here. Oh, there's a fourth one as well. Who doesn't seem to know what's going on? Actually, neither of these do. It's one, two, weird. Well, we'll just deal with the ones that we can see. You do a bonus sneak. Leave no trace. Nice. This way. Now, see if you can do a sneak attack on this brawler. <laughs> Miss? Dang. That's not good. Fight. Let's go. Alright, Dark Urge. You're up next. Don't slow down. That's interrupted. Hopefully that'll hit. Very nice. Ah, oh, you didn't have your um Where's your cloak? Ah, oh, I didn't equip it. Can't equip during combat. That's right. Shadow Heart, you just run over here. Okay, so that's where that fellow is. And this other one is up here. Let's see if Lazel can jump up here. No. On the move. Okay, so these dudes do know what's up. Uh, Stariel's not being too hot. And it looks like we were flanked as well. Not great. Yeah. All right, sorry. Use a health potion. Switch to your melee weapons, and let's see what what can you do. Piercing strike. Yeah, let's go with piercing strike. I'm ensnared, so you have a disadvantage.
one is my first turn. Can move this one first turn. Removed one helps. Hmm. Well, so much for peace. Oh, you've got this jerk in your face as well. Alright. Let's turn someone inside out. Let's just go for a piercing strike. Hope for the best. Yeah. Sometimes the only way out is through. Alright. Switch to your melee weapon. Oh jeez. I didn't equip your good melee weapon. You still have the torch. Screw it. Let's see how this works. Wow. <laughs> Fantastic. Can you go over here and help the stereo? Oh, it's a main action. That's not good. Probably shouldn't be too close to him in that case. You can't shove that fellow, unfortunately. Uh... Uh -oh. Alright, Shadowheart, I want you to take care of this jerk if you can. While also getting out of the acid. Nice. Uh, I'll push shield of faith on you. Heal Astarion because he's hurting the most. What? What? Well, oh, heal yourself. Well, she did need a bit of healing. Anyways, let's get her into the fray. Use your. Uh, you have a cleave, don't you? Disarming, pushing, disarming, pushing. Where is your cleave? That's right. There is a cleave. Cool. That's all I'll have to do for now. Oh jeez. How did this goblin warrior get such a high crit? Man, looks like we're gonna wipe here. <laughs> Despite everything. Help Starion. And then back up as much as you can. Hmm. We're gonna end the turn. Alright, sorry, now you should be able to actually hit this fellow with the main hand attack. Nice. Alright, you also need to 
get out of line of sight. As much as you can, anyway. Oh, didn't quite help. Does this thing now have a, a opportunity attack? Go for a prepare, and then. Deliver a main head attack to this warp. Nice. Take a health potion as well. Yep, we're gonna go again. Do another attack. I'll try to last right this time. Sweet. Now we're gonna get up in this goblin's face so I can't move hopefully or you can't move without taking some damage all right so i want to help astarion but this goblin's probably gonna be more problems if we just let them hang out I don't think anything we do at short range here is going to be super useful. We can shove them though, it is a bonus action. So we got 50% chance, but we have too many options. Ooh, nice. Alright, now we can probably Eldritch Blast them. Let's get a bit further, actually. Because we are. Four meters. Let's get up to this stair. The first set of the stairs in this. Okay, so we could get a little bit further. Alright, so for the best. Sweet. Alright. So next turn. Dark Urge should be able to help Astarion. Poor Shadow Heart. <laughs> so that jerk's next. It's probably gonna take a shot at Dark Urge. But it looks like um, there's only two enemies left. This sneaky archer and this other sneaky archer. Nimble escape. Alright, Lisa. Can you reach this person? This goblin? My path be true. This should be close enough for an attack, right? Let's try and disarm them. Or just outright kill them, that's fine. <laughs> Alright, next turn Lazel could go and help um, Shadow Heart. Alright, Dark Urge. This individual is definitely dex based, yeah. So let's do a dex hex, as I like to say. Now we'll try an Eldritch Blast. Oof, that's not good. Let's continue retreating a bit actually instead of helping us already on. Because this goblin is going to be focusing on us. Ooh. Let's try some missile snaring. Nice. Alright, you go over here and help Shadow her. She's pretty close to dying. Alright, you climb up here, and if you can get to that ledge, 
Okay, let's do it. Dark Ridge. these trolls over here, which I don't think we want to mess with. They're all pretty strong. Hmm. Let's see. So we could do a short rest, I think. And that will recharge most people's things. And the only thing that won't be recovered is Shadow Heart's one spell slot that we used. So let us backtrack just a bit so we don't aggro those trolls, and then we'll do a long rest. Wow, so much blood. <laughs> Alright. Very short rest. Let's go hurt someone. Still breathing, despite everything. Keep your distance down. Wits and blades always shock. Is that blood? No, never mind. We should uh, equip and re-equip some things. Because I forgot to do that last time. That looks like everything. Or Dark Urge. So... Oh wait, no, that wasn't everything for Dark Urge. They had this and they had a great club. Save the torch. No, we definitely want her to keep the great axe. Starion, you're fine, I think. What's next? And Shadow Bar. Yeah, she's fine as well. Let's do a quick save. And then we will loot those goblins. Kind of a sloppy fight, but we got through it. They can all be winners. Also, Dark Urge, your inventory is getting pretty full. What is this? Rags? I don't know why I picked up rags. It's not super useful. We'll just give all the loots and broken loots to Astarion. I'm just evenly or somewhat evenly distributing all of these. Alright, that should be good enough. Eager for battle. Can't afford to stay idle. And 
these things have stayed interesting. Skeleton here. Ooh, they had a ruby ring, which isn't worth that much, considering it has a, an actual ruby in it. Cracker slicer. Alright, everybody, be careful of the acid. And then just draw their crack. There is the cellar, which we want to find now, which I think is in here. So let's all go inside. on the map. It says it's like here. Oh, so it's behind us. Somewhat? Oh, there's a something shiny over here. the summer. This is like a, oh, there we go. There's a wooden hatch here. Okay. So the little icon was dead on. All right. So I think that's a good place to call it for this episode. When we next pick up, sorry, when we next pick up, we will continue exploring, or rather we will begin exploring the cellar here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and are liking the series, please consider liking and subscribing. It really helps out the channel. Until the next time, friends, happy adventuring. <laughs>